Hello everyone, welcome back to this new tutorial. Shad here from Dravia Studio. And today's tutorial will be about how to create some random texture and shader effect using Lusco. As you can see, I have a simple scene here. I have a box. I have a mesh here. I have make a kind of floor. And you can see. It is already unwrapped here. There is already a texture loaded for the uh, tutorial, but there is no material assigned anywhere. There is also a simple uh, area light for, for the lighting. So you can see we have this and some Susan Head Monkey. Okay. And now we're gonna make our floor, random floor, using a single texture. As you can see, the wood texture is a simple plank texture, not a floor texture. But we can use it to make uh, our random effect. Create a new texture. Go for glossy or Disney, depending on you. Add your texture. Go to texture image. Select the texture. Plug it in the tissue color. I switch to the color preview mode and you see there is nothing uh, special happening just a texture applied to a mesh now we need to randomize everything so we add a new saturation color so we can randomize uh, the different value here the U, the saturation and the value so how we can randomize this one we need a random per Iceland node you can find it in the util random per Iceland and you can use this one to change the U as you can see the color of each uh, individual plank change and randomly but we can also add another effect so we can control the randomness using a matte node you can increase the value so you see you have some some change in the, the randomness okay nice let's say we want to go with that one but it is not the kind of floor you want inside of your interior so let's say we want to make a proper interior wood plan we need now another use saturation value node duplicate this one and I put the results of the different node inside of the value okay and I put the result in the diffuse color so as you can see we have the switch to material uh, texture preview mode you can see we have uh, a black and white version of our randomized uh, texture you can change it here but this time it is not colored okay this is nice and we want all that to be uh, not black and white as it is now we need it to be uh, colored so we put this uh, here this uh, the texture here in the color version so we have the texture color here but we have different value and different kind of uh, value for the same texture this gives us some randomness and you can also mix all that with a mixed material so you get some you can control the color mat you add the color mat so that you can control how strong is the 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 color of the random effect so you add a random uh, okay switch to color mode so as you can see i have the random color coming here and i have the raw texture coming here and they are mixed here and you can switch from one to another and you can mix them both so that you can control the the strength of the effect on your floor okay as you can see we have a small 
effect small strong strength and you can increase to make it full strength you can see okay okay this is nice okay so we have our random uh, floor and now let's say you want to apply some uh, this kind of effect not for texture but for material color so i have this uh, susan they are duplicated using uh, alt d like this alt d okay delete and, and i select the susan and i use a new texture okay and if you look closely i can change the texture they will change because they are duplicated using alt d okay if i enable screencast here it is alt d you duplicate so each uh, each uh, mesh will share the same data so you have this one and we have a single color on them so let's say we want the same mesh but we want a different color okay you have to go to the node uh, to add a new node this one is here it's called object id you can in the object id and you have the mode is color you select the color and you plug it here and you have some random color also as you can see you can have different kind of color for the same one and you can control the randomness of this uh, uh, shader by using a remap node you can find it here remap in the mat remat remap okay put it here and you can change the value here to make them more saturated or you can change the different color like this and this is it so this is all about this tutorial for now so thank you for watching make sure to subscribe and to support the channel on the patreon see you the next time